Jim Tennant, 91, Knightswood. My school. I went to Newlands Primary School in Parkhead. It was a solid red sandstone building with swings at the front and a shelter at the back. I was called up for school in 1933. I stayed less than five minutes away, so I was never late. I liked going to school to see my pals and the teachers were good and fair. Favorite subject. The headmaster, Mr. Bullman was very keen on poetry and I especially enjoyed his English lessons. I continue to write poetry to this day. Least favorite subject. I don't really have a least favorite subject, I remember being interested in them all as the teachers were enthusiastic and fun. Read more, T. Merchant Thomas Lipton is a Glasgow legend. Favorite teacher. I was never very clever but the teacher who brought me to life was Mr. Smith. He knew how to talk to children. He told us about skyscrapers and said some of us would get married and live in one. He was right. He also spoke about spaceships being powered by something the size of a packet of salt. That got me thinking of Flash Gordon. I watched him at the Black Cat Picture House's Penny Matinee. Along came the war and my younger brother Tom and I joined the other children at Parkhead Railway Station for the evacuation. Mr. Smith and Miss Brown came along with us. We went to a very small country school in Beatock. I was the only child to sit the 11 plus exam. I passed it, thanks to Mr. Smith. Read more, this is what happened when legend Judy Garland visited Glasgow. As many of the evacuees dwindled back to their homes there was no need for two extra teachers, so they went back to Glasgow. I heard they got married. My brother Tom and I stayed in Beatock the longest. Tom wanted to go home so I had to go too. I was sorry to leave as the folks who looked after us were wonderful. We got home in time for the bombs. School dinners, packed lunch or home? The we evacuees in Beatock were taught how to grow potatoes but we were not allowed to go tatty hawken. I think this was only a job for the farmer's son. The potatoes were used to make soup for our lunches at school. The soup was made outside in a large metal pot. We stayed in school for lunch because the house we were living in was too far away. If I could change one thing about my school days, I would not change a thing. If you would like to take part in our best days of our lives feature, send answers to the questions above and a picture of yourself from your school days plus a contact email address or telephone number to Anne Fotheringham, Glasgow Times, 200 Renfield Street, Glasgow G23QB or email anne.fotheringham at glasgotimes.co.uk For more on this story, visit the news article link.